so I'm pretty much updating this whole thing um because I'm extremely extremely excited <sighs> literally 6 37 in the morning and I've been up since 4 a.m. literally 4 a.m. <laughs> give me a moment Back to it. I had a bit of an itch and I didn't want you guys to see me scratching my face. So, and see me scratching, period. <laughs> That'll be bad. Super bad. Okay. Ooh. Well, hmm. Boy, that was interesting. Okay. So, let's see what colored pens we have to do my writing with. Because I figured I should have different writing combinations. So I have my notebook here, and I'm going to show you the pens and the writing. Um, so yeah, I um, just found out that I'm prayers. Like... <laughs> There's no doubts about it. That is a pregnant that's pregnant that's like whoa hmm so yeah doing all I can not to panic right now cuz I somehow have more than one pen in here okay we have more than one black pen in here which is good sort of um my only problem with that is the black pens are actually only supposed to be one black pen so um, having two black pens is kind of cool because if I run out of black because if I run out of black ink you know how that is right so I have certain pens mm. I have black pen purple pen green pen, red pen, blue pen, <laughs> and this one's my favorite one. So we have spirit, earth, fire, water, air. <laughs> because I couldn't find a yellow pen, I had to go with whatever I had in front of me, so This is a keepsake. <laughs> I'm gonna have a keepsake box just simply for um, the pregnancy. I'm gonna like get a shoe box or something and I'm just gonna start putting everything that has to do with the pregnancy in it. And this is gonna be the first thing I put in there. After I'm done going to the doctor on the 10th and saying, look, I mean on the 1st and saying, look, I took this test on. <laughs> I believe today is the 26th, if I'm not mistaken, which means the 26th is the day before the 27th, which means, my darlings, I'm going to have to do redo the pregnancy do's and don'ts thing, but I do believe, if I don't say so myself, does, I have something to cross off my list of, um, days. Yesterday was Wednesday the 25th. Today is Thursday, the 26th, and it is the day 20 of my pregnancy. Day 20 of being pregnant, and I just got a shirt it on. Fabulous. Okay, so today is literally the 26th, so... Today is the day I begin writing my other entries with everything going on. So it is 126.17 and we're going to figure out um, how we're going to plan out all the weeks. And since, um, week, since month one has been written down right here, we're going to add in month two later on. Um, this right here is going to have some little commenting about 
the whole process and the whole way it feels. So there's going to be comments for each week. Um, and this being week three, I have no comments about it quite yet. <laughs> of course, then again, for week one, because sometimes I like to go back to my um, previous entries, and sometimes I like to write down some comments about them. Week one was simple. Simply a time of having a period <gasps> and <laughs> dealing with drama. Week two ovulation week. Lots of sex. Week three. Conception. Positive pregnancy. Test. I'm going to put a parenthesis around that positive because it looks like it's part of the other sentence. And feeling PMS symptoms. Breasts are tender. Nipples darker. Mood swings. Um, peeing a lot. Remember, this is input every five minutes. And I'm also putting in. Um, taking vitamin D supplement and multi vitamin. I have this thing. Um, I don't have any comments for week four yet because it hasn't begun. Um, tomorrow is the last day of week three. And tomorrow is literally day 21. So yeah, I'll have a lot of comments in, in week um, four. But um, to get everything done and set up and ready to go, it's pretty incredible. This right here. That's what I took. Um, is what I take every morning because it has all the vitamins I need as a pregnant woman for hair, nails, body, and everything. As soon as I get prenatals, they'll, I'll stop taking these and hand them over to my wife and she can finish taking them herself. My wife is actually a transgender woman who has a dick and has actually given me a baby in my womb. What? A pagan married to a transgender? What? Yes, bitches. I'm married to a transgender. And we are a family. What? Everybody's gonna be like tripping out over this and I'm just gonna sit there and say, Told you so. So yeah. So let's get to planning each month, each semester. So there's gonna be about several semesters, several days, and several labelings and stuff to do with this. So I've got all my coloured um, things going here. So 
fingers crossed. Um, let's start off with writing the title at the top. Black pen. <sighs> oh, well, it looks like with this one we've got weeks one through four right here. So weeks weeks five through eight month two I'm gonna be right here and I'm probably gonna be doing some commenting on the different weeks but let's do this thing okay so we have day 29 30 31 32 33 34 35 36 37 38 39 40 41 42 43 44 okay so we have uh, day 28 so we're gonna go seven days after that one two three four five six seven I'm gonna put that right there one two three four five six seven gonna put these right here gonna just box that in right there kind of label that in <laughs> and then we have uh, one two three four five six seven so we have the Friday of every month and considering that last one is a Friday we're gonna have this one on a Saturday so we're gonna put an S A there a regular S here an M a T a W a T H an F and we're gonna do the same thing here because it's gonna be S A and then we're gonna have S M T W T H and we're gonna have an F and we're gonna have S A S M T W T H F. So this is literally going to be so, yeah, we're doing this right. <laughs> S A S M T W T H F and uh, little comments in the sections down below are actually pretty cool. So we have the weeks literally marked off and we have these little sections here where I'm just going to sit here and take that and literally put them down. I'm going to put like a section for check marks here because I figured that actually would be a lot helpful, a lot more helpful I mean. Because you know how that is, sometimes you got to be more organized when you're planning your pregnancy and when you know how things are going to go it's a lot better, it's a lot easier. So you have the little check mark section here which is a lot better than having nothing. And we had our last one um, put on the 3rd of February, so two, 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 two. <laughs> For each one, we're just going to start off by putting the twos. Mm -hmm. And we have that one on the third, so we're going to put four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, then we're going to put the 17s after we put more dashes in there because I like to organize my things according to a system I have and even though this is my book of shadows I think it's still important to involve a pregnancy in my book of shadows so we have two 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 because that's the second month of the of the year 
and I believe February 14th is a very important day, so, and we have, um, in bulk coming in, so, in bulk is, uh, gonna start on the 2nd and, um, finish around the sec around the 22nd, so, it's a good time to be finding out that I am pregnant and it's a good time to be giving thanks, so. Fingers crossed, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> of course, and again, um, we all know what the gender is. We all know it's a girl, but doctors are going to complain and say, you know what, you can't use a pendulum to tell you that you're pregnant, and you can't use a pendulum to tell you that you are um, having a girl. Yet the pendulum has told me several times I am pregnant, and it's turned out this time it's right. I am pregnant. I have the pregnancy test to prove it. Right goddamn here, bitches. Right goddamn here. So, yeah. All you people out there that say pendulums are not accurate, go sit on a dick, because this is a real thing right here. Just after I asked my pendulum if I was pregnant, and it did the pregnant motion. The same week, I take this test, and it's a whopping positive. So go fuck yourselves. Those of you who don't believe in the accuracy of a pendulum, there you go, there's your proof of the accuracy of a pendulum. Booyah. I really don't know how many days are in the month of February. I think it's 28, right? So, that's actually really interesting because I have to stop at 28 or perhaps I can check the calendar and see for sure. <laughs> it probably wouldn't hurt. Um, so, um, I'll be doing another video on this in a moment. I'm going to be posting this one, of course, and um, while I'm posting this one, you guys will not be, s I'll be po recording another video and um, doing the accuracy of a pendulum test because I just proved a whole bunch of dumbasses wrong. Deuces. I just proved to y'all that Freya, Diana, and Yahshua, aka Jesus, aka Messiah, aka Emmanuel, aka Son of God, aka Prince of Peace, aka Awesomeness, are all real. So, all of y'all that don't believe in gods and goddesses, well shove it. Deuces! <laughs>